I've been getting a lot of questions on how to train or how to condition, so I wanted to make a quick beginner's guide for everyone. Understand that what I'm sharing is what has worked for my dogs and other dogs I've worked in the past. Your dogs may require you to change a few things to suit their needs. If you need a more tailored and in-depth plan, contact me on Instagram and I'll provide you the resources you need. First on the list are endurance and duration repetitions. This is the type to focus on increasing the muscular endurance and mental focus of a particular exercise or command. You want to begin with the workload that is light or easy on the mind so you can test the dog's stamina and patience to potentially build them to the point where they have the energy needed to last the whole competition weekend. This may look like 10 minute meal runs, increasing the time for a downstay, or increasing the distance for a drag pull. As the program goes on, make sure to do this workout once or twice a week. Hypertrophy and chaining repetitions. This is the type to focus on building the muscles needed for a particular sport or piecing together the commands the dog already knows for the routine or trial it will be completing. What this may require are variations in the workouts and training sessions. This will be in the form of high intensity interval training on a slap meal, combining your focus heels and place commands, or 30 reps at 70% of your last successful pull on the weight pull track. Implement this type of training two or three times a week for the first two months into your program. Last are the strength and proofing repetitions. With this, we dive more into specificity. This will come in the form of training close to failure or applying a lot of pressure with distractions to ensure the dog knows what the task is in front of them. You'll apply this type of training as competition day comes closer so when the day arrives, it'll seem like another day for the dog. You'll do practice pulls making corrections as needed, as others may make their own rally course with cones to work with. You'll be tracking speed during the two minute meal runs, correcting form on heavy pulls, or resetting the routine once an error is made on the course. You'll apply this type of training once or twice a week as the training may be stressful to the point where the dog needs additional rest days with some light endurance for the active rest days. This is what has worked for me in the past and if you need to make adjustments for your dog to succeed then I encourage you to do so. It also helps to have a mentor and some friends to train with who may be able to lend a hand or give advice on weak points you may not be able to see right away. I encourage everyone to give their dog at least 12 weeks to prepare for an event, especially if the event has weight classes in them. If you'd like to see a video on how to find the correct weight for your dog, like and then comment below. Have a good day and best of luck to everyone.